The Story of Malin Kunda. A long time ago, there was old widow with her son named Malin Kunda. They lived in a hut in the village near the sea. They were very poor. Malin Kunda thought, If I stay here, I would have a better life. I have to leave this village and look for a job. His mother was sad to hear it, but she knew that Malin Kunda was right, so she let him go. After her son had left, Malin Kunda's mother went to the beach every day. She hoped her son would return soon. At night, she would pray for her son's safety. She would ask the captain of the ship whether he saw her son or not. But she got no news about Malin Kunda. After years, when she was very old, the captain of the ship told her, Malin Kunda, I met him some months ago. He is now married to a beautiful girl. She is the daughter of a wealthy man. Malin Kundang's mother was very happy to hear it. Thank you, God, she prayed. She was sure that Malin Kundang would return home one day. One morning, a big beautiful sheep dog. A young couple stood at the dock. They wore beautiful clothes. Malin Kundang's mother cried joyfully. Malin Kundang, my son, you are who? She hugged the young man. Malin Kundang did not believe her. He thought, this can be my mother. She was a strong woman when I left. But his wife said angrily, Why didn't you tell me that your mother is poor and all? Then she spit it on the old woman. The old woman cried. She couldn't believe what she heard. <coughs> Mali, I'm your mother. But Mali Kunda didn't listen. He was embarrassed to have an old mother, so he kicked the old woman, yelled at her, Go away, ugly woman. My mother doesn't look like you at all. The woman fell on the ground. She cried, then she prayed, <laughs> My dear God, if he really is my son, punish him. Suddenly, there was a thunderstorm. Big waves hit the shore with a loud noise. They hit everything from big ships to coconut trees along the shore. The thunderstorm was a fierce one. The storm stopped in the morning, but the villagers could see what the storm had done. Not far from the shore, there were rocks that looked like wreckage and the passenger of a ship. People believed that it was Malin Kundang's ship, and Malin Kundang checked into a coral reef. God had punished him.